So what we're going to do now is make the wire armature for your stop motion animation action figure doll. So, right. so you're going to take some wire You're going to need this 18 gauge wire and you can get this at your hardware store. The first thing you're going to do is get a piece of wire and you're going to fold it in half. So I folded this, whoa. Oh, you need to protect your eyes too, I should tell you that. Because the wire can be pretty wild sometimes. So here I have my wire folded in half. And okay. So my wire is folded in half. The top fold here is going to be for the head. Uh, this is just my um, model that I use. Uh, uh, so I like to take it a little bit higher than necessary because when you twist it, it's going to act it's going to shrink in size. I'm trying to work on some. Now for the feet, I also like to take it a little bit below because when you twist it, again it's going to shrink. And for me, I haven't found out how to make this an exact science. I mean, I know some people are really into measuring things, but I don't really, I haven't figured it out. I'm okay with ambiguity, ambiguity, I'm not sure which way it is. I'm just, I'm, I'm okay with things not being perfect all the time in the exact same size. So. You know, somebody out here is going to figure out how to make this a perfect science each time, but <laughs> I'm not that girl. So here we are. We're going to put this down here. So what we're going to do is we're working on having a W. have a nice W shape like this. And what you're going to do is twist it here. Hold it tight. This is 18 gauge. But you're going to need 18 gauge to make sure you're able to bend the pieces. And now you're going to do each foot so I like to kind of ballpark figure here. And we're gonna twist this foot. This is the figure that you're working on right here. So now that you have your W, what you're going to do hold this tight together because you need and if you have too much space, which is, I do, let me twist this some more. Uh, so you're gonna have, to, like I said, you're gonna have to be comfortable with things not being perfect, and you're gonna have to 
really work with the wire to get it to the de your desired shape and size. I don't think I, I don't, any bigger. I don't even know if this is what these are for, but it's what I use them for. And now, I have this. I want to do this cake. together. I'm going to take this down to the hand and fold it right in the middle of the hand. To make the fingers, you're going to need 24 gauge wire. It's also good to make it longer than you think you're going to need and then cut it when you're as you are adding the hot glue to it. You're going to need 10 of these. 